Shoo! Before today's video gets started, before we chop them nuts off of Ralphie the camel, I gotta let you guys know that we are doing a massive blowout sale for ducks and bucks. We've got a ton of new inventory coming in and we literally ran out of warehouse space. Yes, we got Banjo went a little too crazy and we ran out of space. So right now we're blowing everything out site wide while supplies last until it's gone at 50% off. That's right, 5-0 ladies and gentlemen. We've never done it before. I didn't even think they would allow us, but it, 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 when times come to it where you needed you know, space for all the new stuff, by the way, we've got some really cool new stuff that's obviously taking up a ton of space. We need a bigger freaking warehouse. But for now, we decided we're gonna go out and slash all the prices down to help get rid of some of the old stuff. It's still high quality stuff, don't worry, ladies and gentlemen, and get ready for the new stuff. But if you're wanting to get any of the new duck stuff, buck stuff that we sold last year through till now, everything that's on the website right now will be 50% off while supplies last. So if you guys want duck calls, goose calls, you want grunt calls for deer, you want this thermal vest that keeps you freaking nice and toasty, everything we've got coached, jackets, hats, hoodies, you name it. On both those websites, they'll link down in the description down below is 50% off. Like I said, we've never done, I think the biggest we've ever done is maybe 25%. This is crazy. Mine is blown right now. But I know it's not deer or duck season, but your wallet will thank you later if you get it now for next season. I'm just letting you guys know. So anyways, link down below if you guys want to check it out. Let's go cut damn nuts. Shoo! What's going on, folks? How you doing? Uh, rip! Look at the barn. Again. That thing. <laughs> Again. We, we brought stuff down to, oh, you guys are dirty. You're like Banjo, you guys are dirty boy. How's that look better? Uh, yeah, barn, Carlos. Did you, at least you made it out alive, Carlos. How you doing, big boy? Okay. Uh, yeah, look at the barn. Rip! We got to, uh, we're gonna flip that barn back over for the second time. But today's video is not about that. Today's video is finally about cutting my camel's nuts off. That's right, folks, cutting them nuts. Pedro? I Oh, his nuts are getting white. That's what I'm saying. Ralphie, you ready to get your nuts cut, buddy? Greg, George, calm down. Uh, today's adventure, well, we're just kind of prepping everything. We got to make sure, one, do we think Ralph is still in rut? Okay, so I'd say get on all fours and see what happens. All right. Okay. Uh, so we got to see if Ralph's not in rut, we're going to call the vet. Get the vet out here to cut this big boy's nuts. We've been waiting for six months to cut them nuts. Uh, he's been by himself. He's absolutely destroyed the fencing. You can see he destroyed it there, all the way down there. He's got, he broke out twice. He went through the gate. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. He's getting a stance. Oh, he's getting a stance. No, not the stance. No, bro, no. He's flicking it. I think that means he, look at him and Dale. Why does Dale look like that? Dale's just mean mugging. He's posing there for like the next, yeah, look, at he's getting puberty. Look at his nuts dropped. Look at that little goatee going on right there. Hey, Pedro, calm down. No, oh, Pedro. Pedro. Take, take him off. You got, you got ah! No, Pedro. No, Pedro. Ralphie, what do you think, buddy? You guys having a good time? <laughs> we already cut your nuts. Well, actually, we didn't, but your nuts came pre-cut, so. Look at that little goatee. So proud of my big boy, Dale. He's hitting puberty. Anyways, that's pretty much... Hey, Pedro. Pedro. <laughs> no. We're cutting Ralph's nuts off. I don't know if he's still in rut. He still is acting not quite great at this point. We just need to cut them nuts off. It's plenty. It's been plenty of time. I think he's just horny in general. He's just naturally horny. It has nothing to do with rut or not. Like he's just he's banjo. Twenty four yeah. hours a day, buddy is strapped, ready to rock and roll. So, uh, but we need to flip that barn. We need to give the animals a bale of hay. Um, they've already got a bunch of hay there. Ralph, we had to take his hay away uh, because he's not supposed to have. Uh, a, he has to have kind of an empty stomach when you cut him. Uh, and then we need to take his water away tonight, which we'll do that. Um, but that's why he doesn't have hay. If you guys are curious, um, we just took it away last night. It's not that big. What? What's he saying? Does he say, I'm not horny? Don't pl please don't cut my nuts. Don't cut my nuts, I'm not horny. Too bad! Them nuts are getting cut and we might eat them. We looked it up, you found somebody smokes them, right? Oh uh, yeah. Throw them on the old pellet grill. In Syria, and apparently it's like a common thing. I'm down, and Andrew Zimmerman ate it. Uh, yeah. Right, and that who yeah. it was? Well, he's alive, so I think we'll, we, we'll be all right. So we might, we might. I don't know. We're not gonna do that today. We'll have to do some more research, but we might do camel nut catch, clean, cook. That's kind of what we're thinking. Big boy Ralph, excited, buddy. All right, let's go. Uh, let's try to get this barn flip. So we need. I got the scale loader. We got some tow straps. Try to roll this thing over. We also bought some uh, stakes that are like auger bits. We can stake it down, rebar it down, uh, and then we might actually try to spin the barn. So it's, the reason why it's going that way is the wind blows from the south all the way up the road and then throws it. So if you pivot it, it should be all right. So we're gonna give it the old 90 degree pivot. Is that 90 degree? Yeah, nine, 90 degree pivot and stake it down. So we should be good to go. Anyways, you guys stay tuned. All 
right, barn, it needs to be flipped. So uh, this has happened once before. Ugh, ugh. Yeah, uh, so I'll probably put the bucket of this, we'll probably put it down on here, pull it, lay it flat, and then we'll have to put a strap. We've got a toe strap. I'm not sure how we're gonna use that because you can only loop it once, but we'll, we'll make it work. We'll, we'll figure out a way to do it somehow. But how does the fence hold up? Do all right? Do we pop, did we puncture any holes? Well, it bent up the metal a little, but it didn't It didn't pop any holes. I don't, I don't think. Look, it's holding up. That's a nice fence. The real question is, how does this fence hold up to this, but not Ralph? Uh, Ralph can just curb. Ralph, Ralph just destroyed it. Awesome. Yeah, Ralph's just a unit. So, all right, well, we're going to curl the bucket. I'll try to get this thing flipped once, figure out how to flip it twice. And then, uh, like I said, I think ideally we pivot it, give it the old 90 degree switch, and then we'll stake it down. Stay tuned. I backed up a little bit. I was like, what if it just keeps going? And then I'm just inside it and I can't get out. Really? Structure. There you go. Yeah. I thought it was gonna go. Out of the way, Dale. I think it's working. I it's, gonna, it it's, gonna slam pretty, it's gonna slam pretty. It's gonna slam. I should have let it happen. Okay. It's gonna. It's gonna. Uh, it's gonna slam pretty good. You ready? Oh yeah. All right. Yeehaw, good. brother! That wasn't bad. What do you think about that? That's pretty easy. Beefcake barn move now, little CB. Huh. But I think that's gonna help. It can't catch wind now. Is it? It'll just blow. It'll just blow it. But we'll still, we'll still strap it. I think that's better though. What do you think? I think so. Like that better. Yeah, air freshener. No, it smells like an ass in here, doesn't it? <laughs> Look how big Dale's getting. Dale, you can ride him. Load. Come here, Dale. Get up, Dale. <laughs> He's so big, dude. Look at him. He's such a grown man. I feel so proud. I feel like a proud dad right now. He's got he's some a big boy going on too. He's got. Yeah, he's getting he's old. Getting don't old. die on me, Dale. He's getting old. Rick, I don't. Yeah, you're still the same dad. Oh God, there goes my hand. How'd that go? Worked pretty good. I say just hammer some rebar in there. What is going on? Oh, he bit my nipple. What are you doing, Dale? Dude, right here. He bit my nipple. No, Dale. God. Dude. That actually, I wonder if it's still there. I'm serious. He got it good. Dude, well, he was, I felt him. He was kind of just biting my coat, and then he just went in for a whole mouthful of tit, you know? What was that? Is that a donkey? It is the donkey, yeah. What are you doing? Felicia. Alright. Barnes moved. Barnes staked. Rick. I wish he had nuts we could cut. He already got them off. That'd be good revenge on him. All he's put me through. Chop them nuts. Alright, should we go see how Ralph's doing? See, see if he's still horny or not? <laughs> Rick. Are you out of your godforsaken? Who bought this goat? Why is he like what, that? Why'd you buy this goat? Dale's gonna get a piece. Of oh, I'm getting horn in the ass. That's fine. All right, now we're gonna go see the camel. Oh, Steve's taking a fat <laughs> right now. Steve. Yeah. Steve's letting one, pinching one off right now. Look at that. So what happens if this camel? Anyone strapped or no? I got a knife. That'll do it. That ain't gonna do much. You want them nuts cut or no? You feeling you feeling good about it? Should we just climb over this sucker? What's going on? These goats on my ass. Why is though? he? He's getting it. He likes itching on your on your ass. Why is he so rough? <laughs> Look at him. That's what, Dale, that did. That's what Dale did to my nipple. What's he doing? He's eating. He wasn't supposed to have feed. Uh, well, is that Jake? Is it feed or? No, feed, yeah. Right. Just don't tell the vet. <laughs> hey, who's a big boy? Come here, buddy. Who's a, I'm scared. Let's all be out of that. Why would you turn your back to him? When he does that, he's ready to mount. A big boy, Ralphie. Oh, who's my big boy? Oh, who's my big boy? Yeah. You get them nuts cut tomorrow, huh? You get them nuts cut tomorrow, huh? Where are you going? I mean, he ain't killed me yet. I think he's calm enough for us to inject. That's all I, that's all I was worried about. How does that work? Are they just going to walk up there or are they using like a tranquilizer gun? Dude, I hope we can shoot him. That'd be sick. Imagine just being like, someone like, hey, I He heard that. He heard that. Hey, easy. 
He don't want his nuts cut. No, I wouldn't either. You have like a, a spotter. He's like, all right, get the wind check. All right, three clicks to the right, and just light his ass up. How far are you shooting? Oh, I don't know. I was, <laughs> far, far enough, far enough to stay away. If you hit him, if you hit him, it takes a minute to kick in. So that initial, like, he's gonna be, you know. Is that what he makes. That's the sound he makes. Like that. You want to get tranquilized tomorrow, huh? Are you safe enough for the vet? I just didn't want the vet to get hurt, you know what I'm saying? Not trying to get sued out here, so. Why is your eye, why are you crying? Oh, he's sad. He says, rip, it's the last day with some nuts. Really? He's literally crying, you see that? He shed a tear. I'd be crying too. Yeah, me too. You gonna get your nuts cut one day? Probably one day, I feel like it's probably. Ah, that hard. sounds scary. Yeah, my big boy Ralph is back. During rut, he wasn't him when he's horny, just like eating a Snickers. All right, buddy, I think we got the, we got the Ralph pack. <laughs> If he kills the vet, you guys saw it here first. It's the vet, not me. We also gave him grain, which helps. That usually, that usually, that usually does the trick. He calms down pretty good. I'm sorry, buddy. We gonna we gonna cut them nuts? Yeah. Okay. Well, he's he's calm as cucumber right now. We may have to entice him a little bit of grain. We'll find out tomorrow morning, eight. I think it's eight or eight thirty a.m. sharp. Vet's coming here. Tranquilize the camel. Cut them nuts. Stay tuned. Shoo! All right, folks, here we go. It is time. Well, no, it's it, it, for this guy. Rick, it's not your day, buddy. You already got that treatment back in the day, buddy. Big boy Ralphie, it is your day. We got the vets out here. They are ready. We had a little pregame discussion. I don't know if we're able to eat these nuts. No, because they're going to have sedation drugs. We can give I'm them to pissed. Banjo. I'm pissed. I wanted to eat them so... Should we Google it? I feel like we should eat them anyway. Just like a, I gotta eat just a nibble, dude. A nibble? You ain't gonna die. Just like, give me a I nibble. Mean, if you wanna eat them, go for it. I think like, we just eat a nibble. One of us has I, think to drive I think we'll be all right. What if you soak them in like water for a couple some days? Salt water? Yeah. Salt water? Yeah. Takes, the blood, takes the blood out, takes the yeah. vaccination out that we give them. Well, okay, Andrew Zimmerman ate it. So how, you tell me they have oh, camels. They probably killed the camel. Killed That's it's probably different. Oh. They probably killed Can we kill them? Like, this is no. serious. Oh, okay, no, we can't. Well, we're not sure. We'll, we'll figure it out later. But uh, we were talking to the vets. They're saying we could either put a halter on him, sedate him. Uh, the problem is he's not really halter trained anymore because, you know, he's Ralph. Uh, and so we've got a dart gun, tranquilizing gun, uh, that we have to hit him with twice, I think is what he said. It's 110 cc's. I don't know. 100 c like I'm not a vet. I don't really know. Oh, look who it is. Banjo's late. Banjo's late. He's late. Did you at least bring us some scooters or something? Did you bring us no. something for being late? No. Oh, what the heck? Ty texted me at 7 and said, be here at 720. <laughs> I blame Ty. Yeah. It takes longer hey, to get to this place hey, than that. Buddy has a fancy group chat. Instead, text just Jake. He texted and asked. He and, told me he asked you to text the group I chat. I blame both of them. So, I was listening to Listen, all that matters is you're here in time to eat some nuts. Yeah. Banjo's excited. I'm hungry. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. So, we have to use a dart gun. You excited? Yeah, that, you, he's good at blowing. He's good at that. Yeah, he's, he's got it. it. What's he doing? He's scratching. He's why, is he, why is he just sitting there? We're going to let the vets kind of do their thing, but we're supposed to use a tranquilizing gun. Uh, I think we have to hit him twice to get him to calm down, go in, clip them nuts. We're not sure. They're thinking that, that the nuts are going to have, like, the whatever we're giving him in it. So if we eat the nuts, we might also get tranquilized. We're not really sure yet. Oh, wow. It's a legit. Nuts, they got the old saw it off. <laughs> what? Wait, what? The, the old iron sight, huh? Yeah. yeah okay. Hope for the best. With, with a screw in it. That's perfect. <laughs> the old pump action. Oh, Days of the Red Rider paid off right you here. Ask a shoot or not? No, I ain't shooting nothing. I'm gonna end up missing and hitting Dale and knock his ass out oh, for no reason. Pizza, that'd be fun. Oh, if you accidentally hit the turkey, no one will be mad here. I promise. Exactly. It, it will be totally okay with that. <laughs> what, a, what a beast, dude! He didn't even know. He don't even. He's like, oh damn. Oh, he's he goes, the damn horse flies are getting me again. It literally probably feels like a horse fly to this guy. He's such a beast, dude. But this is the this is the safest way. You can see he's he's fine. I mean, he's kicking. It feels like a horse fly. The safest yeah. flavor for us, for sure, uh, which is the most important thing. Banjo safety is, is number one here. And then, and then Rick, Big Daddy Rick. He's, he's got it. Oh God. There he is. The old one-two punch. That's good accuracy yeah, there. Out. We gotta get one of those. Wow. <laughs> oh, don't pull him out. Uh oh. No. You didn't. <laughs> <laughs> he says, I, I've never tranquilized a camel before. We didn't realize he could just turn around and no, just, pull, just, just pulls him out, <laughs> throws him back at us. Reverse noodle car, boom, just throws it right back at you. <laughs> well, he's hanging out. We'll give him some time. How long are you thinking? Minutes, Fif probably. 15 minutes. So we'll let you know when Ralph's snoozing. We'll get to cut and stay tuned. So you shoot it in and the hub holds the needle in. Oh, okay. It's like a, the body like a bar melts the plastic and oh, that's why they come and it back falls out. out. Yeah. It's like a bar on a hook. Oh, so it falls out on its own. It falls out. That's slick. It comes so, out on its own. So you, you, you can use them to treat stuff on pasture. We don't do a lot of it. Okay. 
Uh, so you could just go by and hit them, go yeah. down, pull it falls out. Well, usually if you're out somewhere where you can't get them caught, oh. like pink eyes or something in yeah, the summer. Yeah, I got it. That makes sense. I, th- I think we need one. Yeah. I don't know what for, but we need one. Yeah. Come back this way, though, buddy. Lay down right there and we're yeah. good. Kush. Kush. You're doing fucking video here? <laughs> <laughs> well, Ralph's just, he's sleeping right now. Cover his eyes so he can't. He's making, take a nap. He's just hanging out. He's not going to be in any pain in this. Darts are already out. He's literally just, he's sleeping. Just resting. It's no different than getting your dog neutered or spayed or whatever. So he, Actually, you said that's the most similar thing. Right, your dog. The surgical the sur- procedure yeah, is surgical. actually really close. To Not doing quite. It. You don't dart with the dogs. That's weird. <laughs> so, all right. Well, definitely not going to see the cutting on YouTube. Uncut will have it if you guys are part of that. Put that on there. Uh, even though Apple took the app down. So we're be- we're down to a website. So if you guys want to go to the website, it'll be the link down below. But we're gonna get to cutting. We have to tie him up, tie up his legs. So that way, if he does come back a little bit, he can't knock it banjo out and kick him to the other county. We don't really want that. But we we'll go ahead and get the old surgery done. You guys stay tuned. Well, that's it, folks. We got him done, did. You see, he's he's doing just fine. He said uncut, saw everything. You saw him come out one at a time. But we're not. We're thinking. I don't know about eating him. Sedation inside the nuts. We might die. We might die. Yeah, probably not good. So, get him untied here. Let him wake up. How long do you think it'll take before he's 100%? Not not loopy. Half hour probably. Oh wow. He's gonna be ready to rock and roll here in a minute. Oh, Carol's left a little of the steamer. Literally. Get a, get a close to that. Oh, you see the steam. Literally a steamer. That's what I'm saying. He's uh he's hanging out. We're gonna let him get get recovered, hang out, and you said maybe a couple days by himself just to. I'd say a day or two. Day or two. That's gonna swell a little bit, but okay. they say they don't really re- react that badly to it. So. Okay. Well, we'll give him some time. We'll see what happens. Stay tuned. Good. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, look at him. That's it. It's like, it's like getting hypnotized. You ever done that? Can you hypnotize him just so he didn't? No. Uh, no. Go ahead. You got it. No, you got it. Go ahead. What do you think he's thinking right now? He's hiring a kite still, yeah. He doesn't know where he is. He's looking healthy, though. He's not. He hasn't moaned, groaned. He's not in any pain. He's just, he's just vibing right now. My boy! He got the old wide stance going. <laughs> he looks like he's got birth. You ever see them try to come out like a horse straight out of the womb? He's just learning how to walk. He's still not sure what planet he's on, but he's standing. I've been this for months, and it appears to be a success. It's a success. Yeah? Yeah? That wasn't too bad. Hi, right, buddy. You all right? Oh, yeah. <laughs> You're with it now, huh? Yeah, there's no grain, buddy. Sorry. <laughs> he's pissed. <laughs> First thing he does when he wakes up. I need up. some grain. He's hungry. Yeah, he ain't eating for a day, so he probably is hungry. Yeah. Okay. All right. Thanks, guys. Take care. Appreciate it. We are back, ladies and gentlemen. It's been four days. Since the old snippy snippy. Giving Ralph boy plenty of time to calm down. If he kills us now, I don't know what to tell you. It's meant to be. We have a saws off for you. I'll cut your I'll cut your tip off or something. Hey buddy. Who's a big boy? Who's a big I didn't cut them nuts, it was the vet. You go get go get him. So that thing that treatment work or no? Hi, buddy. Yeah, we got some fly spray for them nuts, son. Who's a big boy? Who's a big boy? Oh, yeah. He's all right. He's just going to give you the old squirt. The old fly squirt squirt. You got some on your ears, too. Yeah, he's getting you the old shower. Really? He's it's, like that. No, it's all right. Who's a big boy, Ralphie? Yeah, spray them nuts. We're just getting them flies off your nuts, son. How's, how do they look? No, they don't look awful. Oh, he's spreading it for you. Look at it, he's giving it the old stance for you. Reach in there and get it. Oh, God, right, yeah. Get that one right Woo! Woo, he spread it for you. Hi, buddy. Who's the biggest boy? Yeah, who's the biggest boy? I'm so scared of this guy right now, I'll be honest. Yeah, we can get his ears just a little bit. Just the tips. Oh, shake it off, buddy. Oh, what's going on here? I didn't know you see he's shaking his hump. Shake the hump. Let's see it. That's good stuff, right? Say so shaking that ass. You see him shake that hump? Oh, oh, you sick, you sick bastard. He's peeing backwards again. Ralph. Ravi. At least he's not flicking it. 
Oh, he's about to. He's soaking the old. To he's soaking the tail right now, and then he's about to get it. Am I about to get drenched? If he's if he starts swinging that tail around, we we the nut job didn't do it. Come on, Ralph, make me proud, dude. He, how much you drinking, son? Goodness. He look. He's still soak. He's soaking the tail. He has not flicked the tail once though. This is good. Yeah. This is a good sign. Now you got it. It's weird how life changes. You get excited about different things as your life goes on. Right now I'm excited because my camel is not flicking urine on me. It's it was a win. It's a win for the day right now. He is still, buddy. Sheesh. You're getting it, huh? He seems all right, dude. I, he don't have the, the evil eye look to him that he used to have. It will keep you sprayed down, buddy. He likes that. Yeah, he does. No. But now he's starting to get excited. He's flicking that piss. Okay. Oh, Easy. Easy. No, he thinks I'm flicking piss. That, that, oh, he thinks you're, uh, you're a competitor. Okay. Yeah, yeah. He's going to kill you now for sure. Well, we're spraying him down with some fly spray. Uh, now that it got a little warmer, the flies are starting to come out. They're not bad, but, you know, try to get it kind of in and around his area down there just so he don't, you know, we don't want it to get infected. The flies to get in there and start laying eggs and having larvae spawn from his sack. It's not good for anybody. Do you want larvae in your sack? Me neither. So we're trying to avoid that right now, but give him the old car wash right now. What do you think, buddy? He, so far he's doing all right. So he's, he's for the record, for the record, he's still giving it a stream right now, but he ain't flicking it. Yeah, there you go. Get on. Get, get them fly. That yeah, dude. When he shook that hump, I never seen that before. He, I've seen him shake his head, but he literally went and just his hump went. Brrr. Never seen that. No, that's, a, that's a new experience for me. So the reason why we have the saw. Oh, I think he already ripped it off. So we had him uh, guard it out from his pen right here. Yeah, we probably just rip it. That scared him. Oh, I'm, hey. He didn't like that. It's okay. No, please don't kill me. No. Who's a big boy? He's a big boy. That's you. You're just, you're my friend, huh? Yeah, 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 yeah. It was the vet that cut your nuts, not me. I wasn't here that day. I had something going on. So uh, we had this blocking his hut for the last couple of days because there's a bunch of hay in here and we didn't want him eating it because they were supposed to, you're not supposed to have them. They have a bunch of hay and water like right out the gate. So we were, brought the saws out down to cut this open, which didn't need it. Just pretty much blew it open anyways. It's a little stack all this stuff here for now but this is all just to prevent him from consuming a lot of hay so he doesn't need the shelter i mean he's a freaking camel he'll be fine but in case it starts to rain and he don't want to get wet and he at least has it so watch out ravi all right now he can get in he can eat the hay take a nap if he wants i mean he seems chill. I don't really know, like, we're here. He's not, like, messing with us. He's just riding some. All you guys are like, Flair, sell the camel. He's too dangerous. Listen, we, we, got, we fought through it. Now he's our friend. Isn't that right? Really? Whoa, it's a big boy thinking. You want to go hang out with Carlos or what? Look, Carlos is ready to... <laughs> Carlos wants it. You want the smoke from Carlos or no? We have to be a little careful. Carlos is probably the only animal over there that's ever... Oh, his cock's out. That's ever given Ralph a hard time. He'll he'll chase Ralph sometimes. So we don't really want him probably doing that. So I don't think I don't see any see what's going on. Hey buddy. I'm just checking out that sack. That's all. You just you keep going. Can't really see much up there right now, but it didn't I didn't see any blood. I didn't see anything dripping. It looked like I could see the stitches hanging out. Yeah, walk, go ahead and walk. Give it give it the old walk. There you go. Let me see that sack. Oh, that's not bad. I don't. I didn't see any blood. It still looks scabbed, scabbed up. up. Yeah. So what we have to be careful of is Carlos. <laughs> yeah, rip, ripping it, stitches out. So what we'll do is we'll, we're gonna put them together. This is the first time Ralph has ever had any friends to actually hang out with in. What was that? Was that was that October? But he's been in quarantine for six months. I know it's no fun being a horny camel, but that's what we had to do. You ready to go see your friends? You're going to be reunited? I mean, I guess you've seen your friends a little bit when you guys kept breaking through and stuff like that, but... Carlos? You being good? Oh, we got to put some fly stuff on Carlos. See him twitching? Uh-huh. Yeah, some flies, baby. We need to get oh, some... We need to get some chicken. Uh -huh. Chickens, I should say, not chicken. Oh, got Banjo Oh, you fucker. Why would you do that? Look, he bit my whole... My whole... I, I cut your nuts, you bite my foot? Is that how this goes or what? He, he literally just went down and took, tried to take a chunk out of my old toe. All right, so, yeah, the we need to, Carol! Hey, enough of that. 
Carlos, what's up? do not, if you harass this camel, you're gonna go in quarantine, okay? You don't want that, I promise. Yeah, we got it, we have we have Banjo Jr., the old the old cock down there. Not, not Carlos, the actual, hey! What? It's okay. <laughs> You want to go see your friends? But we need a oh, bunch of, shit. we need to get a bunch of chickens to help scratch and pick out the larva is what I was told to do. But I, I, you see all the animals are starting to, the, it's not bad. Like you don't see, you don't see the flies. Like I haven't really seen any. Maybe there's a, yeah, there's a couple on around his ankles right now, I guess. But you can see everybody's kind of twitching up. So the flies are biting them. Oh yeah, now, now they're looking at his leg, uh, Ralph. Yeah. We better, yeah, we better get that spray on them. So we gotta get the fly traps out and spray. Tis the season, baby. All right, you ready? Who's a big boy? Yeah, you wanna go see your friends? This is for Carol. You ready for the smoke, Carol? Dale, this is a big moment. Look at everybody's. Oh, he's what? Excited. Hey, he's excited. hey, Look you. Out. Hang on, I. Uh oh. Curb's gone. Ralph, you got... I feel nervous with Ralph. Ralph, I will let you see your friends if you could just. Give me a second. Rick, you're not, <laughs> you're not helping. The one day I don't have a knife. We got the sawzall. Hey, who's a big boy? Look how nice he is, dude. Oh, he's just letting you play. What if he bites my nuts, though? He's getting oh, low. Stop. Okay, Ralph, I got it. He's sniffing. Oh, don't. Hey, that was Rick, not me. Don't look at me. Beat his ass. Rick? What are you thinking? Well, you got anything to cut this? Hey, you kinky. Stop it. Okay, can someone let me get the... Get, I I just don't feel comfortable with you here, guy, okay? I'll let you out. I'll let you over. You just... You're kind of in the... Buddy, I want to let you over. I just... I There's some twine that I need to get undone, but I don't feel comfortable getting on my knees in front of you, you know? You're a little intimidating. Why did he just do I don't speak f***ing camel. Why do you keep... Just move! I don't speak camel. I just get I get nervous when I'm down here. Was, hey, like, was that him? Yeah. I thought that was why. Hey, f you. I'll leave you in quarantine. He just bit the shit out of my arm. Hey, no, <laughs> no, stop. Why are they like this? Why do you have farm animals? I don't know. See, I told you I get on my knees. He starts getting kinky with it. He thinks I'm submissive. Submit it. Submits. What's the word? Submissive. I don't know if that's banjo. Okay. I'm trying. Rick's coming for you. Okay, you just tell me if the camel's gonna bite my head off. Right, I'll keep it. Hey! Rick! Rick! No, Rick! You're not helping this go any faster, Rick. I, dude, I'm gonna- oh, I'm gonna- coming down. Hey, you f <laughs> Hey! Should we just get a knife or what? I'll cut that Hey! Rope. I can't believe you took a chunk out of my arm! <laughs> and my on, boot! Full on grip. You watch that. Yeah, how about we come over here? I, I have like one more thing to get it untied with. I'm just being lazy. I don't want to have to go all the way to the mule. <sighs> Son of a gun. What about this? Is this sharp? What is this? It looks sharp. It's metal. Why is that in here? I don't know. Hey! I'll cut your ass. Shank you, like a prison shank. Coming down. God, I'm so close. There, we got it. Hey, Rick. Rick, get him, Ralph. Beat his ass, Ralph. Kick his ass. Get him, Ralph. Beat his ass. Get him, Ralph. I'm watching you. Oh God. Dale's on the move. Well, every, oh, everyone's Why scared of him. Why going over here? They're, they're scared. afraid of him for so many months. They don't like him anymore. I think they're scared. Ralph? Come hang out with Steve, Ralph. Let's make sure you guys are, you guys are chill. Remember how this whole ordeal started? Ralph hooked up with the llama and Steve got pissed. And uh, yeah, it wasn't good. Ralph about killed Steve and the llama trying to breed. Ralph's so, grabbing the green tub. Oh, look at him, look at him. <laughs> Ralph! You want some grain, Ralph? You want some grain? You hungry for the grain, buddy? You think that's, it? You think that's what he wants? He grabbed the, I'm sure, they, I mean, they always want grain, let's be honest. 
Ralphie, you want some grain, buddy? We might have to get, might have to give Ralphie some grain. We're out. Oh, Dale, get out of the, Dale, get out, Dale. You're gonna get stuck in the, the tub there, buddy. What's he doing? Is he pissed? Oh, he's pissed. Why is he coming after me? He's gonna beat your ass. He's gonna try. He could, too. How's that going, Ralph? Kind of, kind of going a little on edge. So Are you, far, Carlos ain't really. Can you not? You guys have water? You need me to check your water supply? I don't like how he's just circling. Yeah, he's, he's swarming like he's about to pounce or something. We'll check their water, but I mean, looking good. Look at him. Look at him. <laughs> you got the old, bu the old bucket there, buddy. Ralph, there's no more grain. We've, we've been giving him grain every day, so it's not like, don't want you to think he's been starving, but we gave him a little bit of grain after the surgery. Yeah, he's getting water, not grain. I mean, you've had, you've had water. It's not like you haven't had water, so I don't see why that would be uh, it's something that you would be wanting, but I mean, no, no one's killing any each other. Right, Carol, how's life being a cow and whatnot, Carol? No, Ralph, don't keep away from the llama. We don't need any of that going on, okay? No, no more. No, no, nothing's here to breed. Steve, you better just stay away, Steve, because he's a lot bigger than you, buddy. Yeah, I know. I know llama's your your gal. Llama, you stay away from camel, okay? No flirting. No flirting with the camel. I know how you get, llama. No flirting. Okay, otherwise we're gonna have to go put them back in quarantine. Or maybe I'll put you in quarantine. You wanna be in quarantine? Dad, I didn't think so. Oh God, here we go. Okay, Ralph, you can't just walk into people, Ralph. Sheesh. Carol, what are you, why are you following him? You, you forget who he was? Why is this goat doing this? Carol, what do you think, buddy? He's following Ralph. Look at him. I don't think there's gonna be any more grain in there. Llama, what I say about flirting, llama? Llama? Quit biting each other's ears and licking each other's neck, you kinky sons of guns. Steve, you can't, you're not gonna win this round either, I promise, Steve. Steve, look at Steve, he's hiding behind his girl. Look at that. No, that's, oh, that's, I forgot, that's Banjo Jr. You guys ain't, ain't met yet. That's, yeah, and that's Pedro. You can kill him if you want. That's, there's no problem there. But that's Banjo Jr. You should leave him alone. Okay, what's going, why you got them, that crazy look in your eyes, Ralph? Why you got that crazy look? You like that tree? I mean, so far, so far we're all right. Yeah, I know. Okay, you like eating that in the wood? I, I'm sure that hay right there would taste better than that tree, but you know, you do you, my guy. I'm just here to, I'm just here to just make sure you don't kill anybody. All right? Now you do. Hanging out. What do you think? You being a good boy? No, those are my shoes. I don't know. Yeah, that's Rick. You can you can beat his ass too if you want. That's fine. Look, Banjo Jr. You meet Banjo Jr. He's just hanging out. Yeah, the leaves, the trees don't have any leaves on it yet, buddy. He'll get there. Hey, stay out of the cow. Listen, we cut them nuts. You shouldn't be interested in nothing, Ralph. Get your nose out of there, Ralphie. Ralph. Hey, 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 Ralph. No, Ralph. He licked her. No, Ralph. No, no. Eh, eh, eh. Carol's off limits. No, Carol. Put it away. You're not open for business. Put it away. I'm not sure we can trust him yet. He's over here biting and licking on people and he's still doing some kinky stuff. I don't know if we can trust him quite yet. Ralphie, we went six months of quarantine and then cut your nuts. You gotta show me something here that I can tr trust you. He licked Carol's cow <laughs> Yeah. No, you can't say that? No. no, he did though. He gave her the old he also uh, went up and bit Llama's ear. Oh, he's still kinky. Yeah, he's kinky. Ralph. No. no. I don't want to be kinky with you. Ralph, you just, yeah, do we need to get a female? You don't have nuts anymore though. Oh, he's hes really, he likes you. Why is he like this? Steve, don't fight his. So funny, when he was biting on Llama, Steve was hiding behind Llama, just like, <laughs> like he, he just posted up, just like, Steve, don't even try it. And then, oh, you should have seen his reaction to Banjo Jr. Oh he, yeah, he, had, he was yeah, like, Banjo what Jr. the hell? And he kept following him around. He's like, who's this guy? Yo, BJ, yeah, he's a good guy. Ralphie, we'll get you some grain, Ralphie. You just, you gotta calm down. Well, who's he prancing with? Nobody. Do you see him? Yeah, he's just prancing around. He was prant. He did was a doing a little sidestep, a little sideways step. Felicia. Felicia. She's so nice. You are the nicest, aren't you? A little sure ass. Oh, thank you. Little hey, ass. Come here, no, a little ass. Come here, little ass. Oh, okay. Little ass ain't a fan. Hey, little ass, what's up? What are you doing? You being big boy? Let me see them teeth. <laughs> Hang bite you. See, he's so much nicer now. I can actually like, Us. I can actually hang out with him, huh? Who's your big boy? Who's your Scooby snack? You want a Scooby snack? So I'm not gonna forget you bit my shoe and arm today, okay? Hey, look at them lips, son. What the? 
Look at them. God bless America. Look at them lips. Yeah, disinfect that thing. Oh, Ralph, what the hell? Why you got them lips? You gonna kill anybody or no? I think we're good. Well, if anything dies, we'll make another video. But for now, Ralph, I think your operation went went perfect. He's uh, he's nice. Look how nice he is. Isn't it great to have Ralph back? Man, six months of just being scared. It, you know, if he breaks out and he's at my front porch, get the old 50, start dumping the mag. That's about my option. That's how I live for six months, in fear of this thing. And now he's just hanging out. He's having a good time. So I said, if he, if he hurts anybody, kills anybody, I will let you guys know. Um, but for now, he seems he seems like he's... Look at that. Just letting you mess with him. I know. He would never let me do this before. He would I would have been on the ground just getting boom, boom, boom before. So anyways, hope you guys enjoyed, Ralph. Good work, my guy. All right. See you guys later. Peace.